together. As I'm mixing the smoke butter sauce, I'm still thinking I need something just to give that sauce a little bit more complexity. I want to add vanilla to the sauce. I love beautiful, soft fish with that vanilla and a little bit of sweetness. I don't want it to be too savoury. Ah, oh, vanilla in the sauce. Yeah, a little bit of vanilla. I want a little bit more sweetness in there. I love how Jim pushes the boundaries with his cooking using all these cool techniques and odd flavour combinations. But I'm a little worried that vanilla might make his sauce a little too sweet. Now that I've got my mousse setting, I need to start the crumb. To make my crumb ball today, I'm going to be using coconut flour. I'm going to mix it with some butter, a little bit of sugar and some of the peanuts. And then I'll cook that in the oven until it's nice and toasted and crunchy. I also decide to add a ginger syrup to the dessert. So I'm going to make my syrup out of water, sugar. I'm going to add some lime juice as well because I don't want it to be too sweet. And then I'm going to put in the ginger as well to infuse. There's definitely lots of pressure, but the cook has gone pretty well so far. I don't know what's happening over at Jim's bench, but I'm sure he's putting up something amazing. So I know I've got tough competition. How are you over there, Ashley? All good? Yeah, I'm good, thank you. How are you? I'm getting there. <laughs> Still kind of making it up as I go. Me too. <laughs> Jim, there's no pressure. There's only your reputation at stake here. <laughs> there's only ten minutes to go. Come on, you can do it, Ashley. OK, here's the baked fish. I'm pretty under control. I've just got to cook this fish. I've still got plenty of time. I'm really unsure of how long the fish is going to cook in these ovens because I'm not familiar with it. So I'm putting smoked butter on the fish just to keep it moist and sort of keep it nice and smoky. Five minutes to go. Five minutes. Come on. This is it. My crumb is ready to go, so all that's really left to do is to start plating. Let's go out. fish, but it looks like the fish is not cooking fast enough in the oven. Yeah. Time's running out. I have to do something quickly to get that fish finished. So I throw it in there, beautiful melted butter on the tray. I think it'll be cooked perfectly, but it's going to go down to the wire. I am feeling very anxious and very nervous. My stomach is in knot about how this mousse is going to turn out. holding its shape, and I think I've managed to get it out OK. Beautiful. This is it. One minute to go. One, one minute to go. I'm looking at my fish, hoping to God that it's cooked. If it's not, I'm, I'm in big, big trouble. Kanash, doing really well. Woo! Worry there with the fish, not quite cooking as fast as I thought it would in the oven. But yeah, pulled it off. The fish, the fish looks pretty good. Hopefully, it's uh, cooked enough for the judges. The combination of coconut water, smoked butter, and, and the vanilla together is really going to challenge the judges' palate. Uh, I hope it, I hope it comes off. Well done. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs> I look down at my dish. I'm feeling pretty happy with it. I am nervous about the mousse. I don't know how it's going to stack up against Jim's dish, but I'm really hoping that the judges love my dish. on a pickled yakama and crab salad with smoked butter and vanilla sauce. What does that smell like? What is that? It smells something like something from the... Uh, it's coconut. Not, not ca no. Coconut water. It is. It's coconut. Coconut water. Yeah, it's husky. What do you reckon? It's red emperor, and I'm always worried with red emperor that you're going to have a... It's quite an elastic skin. Elastic skin, skin yeah. yeah. Just, uh, it doesn't get crispy. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
How's yeah. it cooked, George? Yeah, it's cooked beautifully. It's cooked nicely. Yeah. Isn't it? You know, it's a, it's the kind of dish I can't make my mind up. I've eaten it all, and it, and it really is, in a strange way, very delicious. I, I can't make up my mind whether I like that sauce. It's smoky. It's a little sweet. It's very perfume from the vanilla. But it's like custard. And then eating it with the fish, there's lots of fresh flavours in there. The coconut. I don't know. I mean, I'm still eating it, so it must be tasty. Vanilla and seafood are a good combination, especially with that type of fish. I like it. It, it, it it's a definitely it's a challenging dish. And it's kind of a hard one. Your lasting flavour is a vanilla, and that's a dessert flavour. You can take this dish in two ways. You can either go, that's really clever, it's challenging, it's a little chefy, or mm, I'm not sure if I like there, that. There's coconut water in that, which is naturally quite a sweet mm. water. So I think it's the sweetness that. On, it makes your brain obviously go yeah. custard, mm. vanilla ice cream, melted. You're right. Yeah. But I'm, look, I'm still. Yeah. Because I'm fascinated by it. Yeah, but, but, but are you fascinated or do you just like melted ice cream? All of the above, really. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Shall we oh. score? Well, it's a hard, it's a hard dish to score. Right? It's a really hard dish you to know, score. It could be a one, or it could be like a high, or it could be a, a medium. Right. Mm. Oh, I'm not sure. Let's get the next dish in, boys. All right. Passion fruit semi-fredo, chocolate mousse and coconut crumb. I think that screams Ashley, that dish. That's her kind of presentation. But her Achilles heel is chocolate mousse. because that is so delicious. I get ginger, I get passion fruit. Like, it's got this so much going on on this plate, but funnily enough, it all goes. I it's, like it. It's like going to one of those tropical fruit farms, you know, up kind of Budrum Way or, you know, further north and, mm. and you know, smelling the ginger plants and, oh, yeah. The warmth of the ginger is beautiful with the chocolate. I, don't, I think the thing that makes it stand out is you get cold, sharp semi-fredo and then you get a warm chocolate mousse. It's kind of got that, that fluffiness. It isn't lovely and It's a dolloping and... mousse. I love it. Scores done. Scores are done. We know what the results are, don't we? Will it be unanimous? Let's oh, go yeah. find out. <laughs>